Hello and welcome to Interactive CAD and Tech. Today I'm going to be showing you how you project text onto a part in Shaper 3D. So just to get started, I've got a blank modeling area and I've got it looking at the top plane and I'm going to go to sketch. I'm going to draw a rectangle from the origin and I'm going to draw it 1000 by 1000. So a meter by a meter, I'm going to close that. And then I'm going to go to tools and I'm going to go to extrude. I'm going to click my extrusion. I'm just going to angle it a bit better. I'm going to extrude it up 100 mil. Like that. And then tick done. So now I've got a blank part and I want to put some text on the top of it. So I'm going to go to the top plane again and I'm going to go to uh, tools. Not tools, sorry. Uh, that's where I'd put it if I designed the software, but anyway, add text and then I'm going to put in interactive CAD and tech, which is the channel name, and I, which I can't obviously can't spell right. And I'm going to write underneath, please subscribe. So if you find this little tutorial helpful, please do uh, subscribe to the channel to support. All support is appreciated. And then I'm just going to put it cent central and I'm going to make it about 50 mil big. So the alignment central, 50 mil big, you can change your font if you'd like to. I'm going to click continue. So now I can't see it because of the part. So what I'm going to do is just press shift and rotate it around. I'm going to pull it up 100 mil. So let's type it in 100 to get it on the top surface. We'll click done. So now if I rotate it around, you can see that the that this text is coming as a sketch plane. So what I'm going to do is click the sketch plane, click more, click project, and then click the surface and click done. So now if I hide the sketch, you can see etched onto the part is interactive CAD and tech. Please subscribe. So if you found this little tutorial helpful, uh, please do subscribe to the channel and thanks for watching.